How you doing? Words of wisdom, you know what I'm saying? Episode one, I'm Gillis Can. I'm from Louisville, Kentucky, and I'm going to talk to you. My name is Giles. I'm going to let you know some things about if you're trying to get involved uh, in hip-hop in your scene or if you're trying to, you know, r you know, rap locally and collab with people, some different things that you can kind of do to get started rapping. Um, so the first thing, obviously, that you want to do is make sure that you get like a foundation down of like what you are trying to convey or where you come from or what you're trying to do. The second thing I would say is make sure that you uh, surround yourself with people that are similar minded, similar end goal. They understand what you're going for. For me, I've never been in a position where I've had just like people around me always pushing for me to do events and like be a part of things and stuff. You know what I'm saying? And, but I always just kind of weaseled my way and found a way to do it. So it's like, you just got to take the step to actually get involved. You're not booked for something, fine. You can still go, you can watch it, you can have a good time, you can vibe there. I go to like shows that are not hip hop shows and it's like live music and I'm like going ham, having like the heaviest vibe type situation. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, other times? Not so much. So it's kind of all over the board. That's another thing too. Being steps ahead. Like I'm not, one thing doesn't sell you completely as another thing. You know what I'm saying? You can really push. You can really push for an idea and then like do a couple more ideas that are like mm -hmm. let's just add to the resume. Let's just keep building. So the biggest thing is just getting yourself in a position to be comfortable with putting yourself out there because I think people need to hear. People need to hear your music when you hang out with people and stuff. You spend so much time with them. Like if they don't, if it's not produced very well or anything like that, like you can explain the context of where you were at when you were making it and like what it meant to you. And maybe that will relate to someone. Like there's just different ways to build it when you're when you're actually with people versus like what you think you can do. You can like go to shows. You know what I'm saying? Is the first step. But I'm saying outside of that, you can like go to venues and you can like try to speak with management and try to just get book gigs and stuff like that. But it's really, it'll be a lot of dead ends. These places want like what's called an EPK, which is like an electronic press kit. Um, and that in and of itself is important because it's like a digital resume type situation. So um, moral of the story is when it comes down to anything that you're trying to do on a local level, you have to stay true to yourself and follow the vibe of what you stand for and what you do. You don't have to worry about anything else. That's all you have to worry about. Being yourself and learning to grow within hip-hop. And hip-hop gives the most opportunities of anything. You listen to different instrumentals. They give you different vibes. You become you, you come like upon different trains of thought that otherwise you wouldn't think. So it's like, it's it'll get you where you need to go. You just need to be able to like really kind of take a step out and... Do it, and you know, the worst that can happen is you fail miserably. Guess what? If that's the worst thing that happens to you in rap, it's like, pfft, you're good. It's straight. So that happens to tons of battle rappers. It's unreal. It's unreal. So, um, yeah, that's it. Words of Wisdom, episode one. You know, I'm just going to touch on some different things. This was just about, uh, like, getting your start and what to do on a local level and just kind of putting yourself out there. Um yeah, and the last thing I would say that's probably most important is make friends. All people like music. Listen to their Spotify's. Listen to their vibes. What are they about? Who's their favorite? Who've they seen live? Blah blah blah. Go through the motions. Get to get to understand where people are at. Words of wisdom.